नमस्कार आई अशोक कुमार वेलकम यू ऑल टू उदय इंडिया डिजिटल टुडे आई विल टेल यू अबाउट द कंटेंट ऑफ उदय इंडिया दिस वीक दिस वीक्स कवर स्टोरी अगेंस्ट द बैकड्रॉप ऑफ एयर फोर्स डे ऑन अक्टूबर एट इज ऑन हाउ इंडियन एयर फोर्स इज फ्लाइंग हाई इन द फील्ड ऑफ सेल्फ रिलायंस इंडिजनाइजेशन मेक इन इंडिया एटसेट्रा अंडर द लीडरशिप ऑफ पी एम नरेंद्र मोदी एंड रक्षा मंत्री राजनाथ सिंह Air Marshal Anil Chopra emphasized that it is well understood globally that the one who controls air and space he controls the planet. Group captain AK Sasdev reveals that since BJP came to power in 2014 self reliance has been a major area of attention by the government with Prime Minister Modi personally backing it. Nilab Krishna affirms that Raksha Mantri Rajnath Singh is not only bringing an overall change in the defense of this country but he has always been in forefront in realizing the defense forces aim to become self-reliant. Dr. Samir V. Kamath, chairman of DRDO in an exclusive interview to Deepak Kumar Rath, editor of Uday India, explains how DRDO is making the country a global leader in defense R&D. Next CB Anand Krishnan CMD Hindustan Aeronautics Limited or HAL in an exclusive interview to Deepak Kumar Rath delves deep into pointing out how HAL 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 is investing big in research and development Bhanu Prakash Srivastav chairman Bharat Electronics Limited or BEL in an interview to Anshuman Anand news editor Uday India outlines that BEL stands for electronic revolution in India Deva Mohanty in his article explains Indian Air Force Odyssey to transformation Amartya Sena advocates that possessing hypersonic weapons will always increase India's diplomatic weight at global high tables and will also provide massive strategic and tactical advantages against Pakistan and China Rakesh Kumar in his article says The line of actual control which was ignored for developing infrastructure has got its due recognition with four new airports and 37 helipads being planned across the union territory of Ladakh similarly Arunachal Pradesh now has 11 airports including three commercial airports and the fourth one coming soon RSN Singh writes how Canada is nurturing anti India Khalistani supporters on its land He further writes Project Khalistan was fathered by the US in partnership with Pakistan as the latter was licking its wounds physically and strategically after the defeat at the hands of India in the 1971 war. Finally Deepak Kumar Rath in his editorial writes how Indian Air Force is surging high under the leadership of PM Narendra Modi and Defence Minister Rajnath Singh. With this I wrap up this edition.